This is Minister Sean Michael Lewis back with another weekly snack, and I'm excited about this week's word. It comes from Psalm 27, verse 14. Wait on the Lord, be of good courage, and he shall strengthen thine heart. Simple subject today. Wait on God. Wait on God. Can I tell the truth? And shame the devil. When somebody tells me to wait, I love to say that I love it when they tell me that. But no, I can't lie. When somebody tells me to wait on something, I don't like it. Two reasons. Somebody has promised me something. I've waited on it. And they've never come through. But also, who loves to wait? When we live in a microwavable, touchscreen society, if I can go on Amazon and order something within a day and it'd be at my front doorstep, I don't like to wait. But however, when God tells us to wait, we have to realize there are benefits to his waiting. Waiting builds character. It builds trust. It builds dependence. It lets us know that we aren't in God's category. God is still in a class all by himself. So here we find in this text, David saying, wait on the Lord and be of good courage. So when we wait, our attitude ought to be courageous. We ought not have a stank face, a stank attitude. We ought to be of good courage because we serve a God that will follow through. God is not a God that will promise and not come through. Matter of fact, the Bible says, God is not a man that he should lie, nor the son of man that he needs to repent. So wait on the Lord, be of good courage, and he shall strengthen thine heart. I know somebody watching right now may have had a broken heart or may have a broken heart right now, but I'm so glad, like the old folk may say, he's a heart fixer. God will put your heart back together again. I know your heart may have been broken that in March the semester was shut down. I know your heart may have been broken because there have been some loved ones you couldn't say goodbye to during COVID-19. I know your heart may be broken with Donald Trump in the White House, Pinocchio with a toupee, but I just want to let you know, wait on the Lord. Be of good courage, and he shall strengthen thine heart. It doesn't say might. It doesn't say maybe. It's not uncertain, but he shall. The Bible says weeping may endure for a night, but joy will come in the morning. So I just want to let everybody know that waiting on the Lord has benefits. Waiting on the Lord will produce miracles. Waiting on the Lord will take you to a level you ain't seen before. So just one thing. Wait on the Lord. Be of good courage. And he shall, he shall strengthen your heart. God bless.